All right, guys, so I thought I'd do the write-up I, I said I was going to do on the uh, the headlight that I had that was busted. So I had a, a adjuster screw that was stripped out and busted. This housing was pretty much, I had I did have it pull tied up here in the end of there, uh, that hole there, because uh, it, had, it was busted, and if I didn't have it pulled tied up there, it was, gonna fall, it was just going to fall forward. So what I did was uh, I went and got some 10-32, two and a half inch long screws and uh, I put a washer on the front side washer on the back side of the screw put it in there before I done that though I got some JB weld the part that was busted was still in there so I kind of got it back together the best I could and put some JB weld on it let it dry for a couple hours after I thought it was dried to my likings I came in and uh, put the uh, Put a washer nut on the front side, washer nut on the back side, tighten it up in there good. So now pretty much it's fully adjustable with a flathead screwdriver. And if I can get it to adjust, there you go. Fully adjustable with a flathead screwdriver. And uh, if you don't want to if you're searching around trying to find these buckets then you already know that uh they only like to sell them in pairs and they're like 80 anywhere from 80 to 120 dollars for a pair sometimes more than that uh it was hard for me to try to even find a single one so that's what i did cost me a dollar 30 you'll have to buy the washers i have washers laying around that i use but uh you get the washers the screws everything it, it'll fix it and you can see it ain't it ain't going nowhere it's in there uh and you can adjust it in and out again uh i got you know i got it where i can adjust it now i couldn't adjust it before but now it's fixed so here's what it looks like stock so you get an idea what i'm talking about that, that's the one i'm talking about and you see this housing looks like it's starting to maybe split apart a little bit here on this side so i may end up having to do it on this side i put a lot of headlights in my jeep probably 14 different sets so uh i've 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 you know adjusted adjusted these a lot and uh you know they're just getting wore out and uh i may end up just doing it on this side uh anyway but until it busts i may not even mess with it you can see this one's got more wiggle to it than the other side you see that that one's got a little, little bit of play this side it's in there it's not it's, it's a lot tighter, so I'm guessing I'll end up having to do it on this side. But if you got any questions about it, message me. And uh, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up. And uh, subscribe to me. This is Jamie, Jeep Nation.